Hey everybody, it's Boys of the Most Toys coming at you again with another G1 LEGO Transformer and this time it was time to, you know, update my G1 Wheeljack. It's been many, many years. Uh, you can see here he is a stock car kind of thing and he rolls well in the back wheels but the front wheels are very tight in the hub so they don't roll very well. So. It does kind of roll, but it is tight. He won't fly across the room. So guys, if you want this guy, he will be added to our roster of instructions you can purchase from our website. So you can click the link below or at the end of the video and check out our catalog. So let's get to transformation. Transformation guys, I'll try to keep my hands out of the way, but you want to take the car section like this in your hand is the best way to do it. And you want to go to the sides, of course, and you want to pull out the sections, which will become the arms. You're then gonna go, you can see all the rest of the guts on the back, but you're then going to go and loosen the cockpit and get it out of the way so you can move other things around. And you can see from the side here, there are other things to do. So we are going to get this section off the back, which will become the wings, move it out of the way, and we'll set up the wings later. That frees up what will become the legs. So we're gonna go to the front of the car. We're going to turn it down like this, and we are going to separate the two components like this. I'm gonna go to the back. You're going to have little heel spurs that come down to keep him up in robot mode. So we'll just go along and do that. And our little connecting peg um, just came out. No big deal. It's very stiff on one side always. So then to complete things, you can see we've got like a short stocky robot here. You're going to bring the section up which becomes the head. And then you're going to bring up the cockpit section to become the chest. Pose out your legs however you want. They're on all nice ball joints. You're gonna then bring the side panels around 90 degrees and they become the forearms. You can pull out in your hands however you like. Do the same on the other side. And you have now got yourself octan version of wheeljack and to complete the model of course you can put in his g1 inspired or cartoon inspired shoulder cannon doing this you have to rotate the shoulder joint around 180 degrees so that you have studs pointing up and then you can put on that shoulder cannon you can see here there's wheeljack his short little stocky self he's got articulation in the knees ankles shoulders of course and his elbows his waist also will swivel to a certain point you go around the back oh i did forget one step you want to go around the back and you want to pick up take out his wing pieces and you could put them out however you like just like the g1 toy and there you go so there's Wheeljack in his G1 glory with lots of posability. He's a, a little taller or maybe the same size as my old version. I can't remember. It's been so long and I did wreck him to salvage for this guy. Of course his head too on a nice ball joint. And you can put him in some cool poses. So if you, as, as again, if you want to get this guy you can go order the instructions from our website in the link below or at the end of the video. Thanks for watching everyone. Don't forget to subscribe. Happy building. Take care.